Welcome to Crestorio, my name is Nilo. this is episode 23 of our Let's Play campaign. Let's uh, look at Trent here, small Trent there, this triangle thing is still a very intensive need for copper. Basically we're just building up our giant stockpile here, so that's kind of the reason why this is just constant. They've also been quite a lot faster during work we've done. Uh, we've expanded out here. I have fixed the miscalculation we did last time and it looks better now. Whoa, I didn't want to go in here. I actually wanted to jump out there. And what I want to do, because it takes so ungodly amount of time. Uh, I want to do a couple of things. I want to make this one. So copy paste, get a bit of everything in here. And this does take a bit of time to craft. How long time? Ten, 20 seconds. That's kind of a lot. And I will now get these to 20. I will take it up here. Hmm. That one. And I'll get 50 of those, which means I don't need 50. I do need 100 here. I need 50, that should be fine. Uh, however, this is not going to work unless we also built speed modules and module cases, which means I need speed modules inbound here, which is going to be an absolute disaster. Not going to lie about that. That's going to be a disaster getting that in. Um, probably this one is a bit too bit too big for that one here so this one will now be a balance because i'm not going to use that much that means we can go out here this one 1k and let's also get and this is going to be really horrible and i don't need the other ones just yet at least uh, so we will get these in but they will also just fast be consumed because we need all of this to be improved. Hmm. Well, we don't, but some of them we need to be improved, right? These are just chugging along at a 20 second craft, no 10 second craft, which means I need a 20 second craft up here. There, we're going to use these for the time being. Anything else? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. now, now there's the, the big one, the nuclear reactor. Copy, paste. So, just request all of it. Let's see if there's anything we're not getting. No, it looks like we're getting everything here. It all looks fine. It's going to take a while to fill up, but... That's, again, it's not really a problem, is it? I can just do that one and go... And it started. I think this might be a good candidate for um, the first one here. So you build that one, and let's throw in two of these. How many nuclear reactors do we need? I have no clue, but we might need a few. So let me just get 10 of those. This is just one of those that will continue. So it's working on a crafting speed of 2.2, taking 25 minutes to craft or something to that effect. <laughs> so just start building them, all right? And we'll come back at some point and see if we have any. It's not going to use very much materials in the grand scheme of things. The Coverex process is slow, but moving forward, not moving backwards. Let's have a look at what this monstrosity I built last time, how I fixed it. Uh, I have done this part. This is, these are now speed 130. That means it is outputting instead of 10 per second, it's outputting 13 per second. It's not using so much power, but 13 per second. This is actually consuming 16.67, so not quite right, but the fact is that I could put them directly in, which meant that they used a lot less power or a lot less um, space. And you can see I can just fiddle this back and forth by voiding all of these in the middle here. So it was kind of uh, finicky. And this one here, I think this is quite neat. This goes in. And then it goes in here first and there. And there's just room for it. It's just so damn tight. 
and I couldn't squeeze in more and it's working if if this is working 1.3 so that's 3.9 what's 1.3 50 5.2 10.4 is the crafting speed 10.4 is the crafting speed and that means total crafting speed that means it produces 104 instead of 10 salt water per second it's 1040 per second so 1040 it'll be turned into half of it oh that's interesting are you oh okay it's, it's because it's it's saturated good and the reason why it's saturated is because this one is stuck so we can't consume anymore I've kind of moved it down here so it didn't get in trouble and we're gonna build another one you know instead of building it in several sort of layers just build this one first and then we find you're gonna build basically the same as this one hmm okay One, two, three. Max squeaky pants. Oh, I misspelled it. No. I think it's Max squeaky pants. And this one will be building tantalum plates. Tantalum plates. We don't really need those right now, but we do need it. And then I have prepared a bit by taking this exact thing that we did last time. Oh, not last time, some time ago. Let's see if we have everything here. I don't know if we do, but it's gonna get there. Hey, look at these robots. They are so fast. And everything got sorted. Nice. That's input mode. Nope. Output and input, input, input. Yes. All of this. But now instead of making titanium and coke, we'll now make tantalum by tantalum and coke. Not to tell the difference, but it is there. Boom, 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 tantalum. That goes in. Could be putting modules on it, but I don't. Ah, no, 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 I, need, I knew I was missing one. I need one more to put in here. That one. And... This one will be Coke. Be simple. Got it. And this one will be Tantalum. Copy, paste. And they'll, they'll probably work here. Probably work. Everything is inbound. We got a first bit of Coke coming in. And let's see if it works. This one obviously is going to change to tantalum. Do we have any idea what we're going to use tantalum for? Not really. Uh, let's see. Tantalum. Here. Immersite processing. Makes tantalum plates. Electric mining tools three. Titanium. An Immersite. Aha. Immersite is interesting. That's a really good mining drill. And oh, okay, that's not a matter thing. We don't need that. Uh, let's uh, let's go from here and then just see what it goes in. It goes into Immersite energy. Immersite energy is not a single bit of tantalum anywhere. One tantalum paid for the Immersite battery. 
titanium plates. I'll just Chancellor plate here, big personal battery. That's kind of not a lot. That one is not even an item. Uh, this one, Immersite Energy, goes into some... It does feel a bit strange, doesn't it? Like, why am I getting this again? Because, or, or what am I going to use all of the Tantalum for? It doesn't seem like there's anything we need Tantalum for. I mean, yeah, we can we can make some Tantalum here, but why would I? I have so much of it. I am very puzzled by why we need what we need tantalum plates for. This is the Menorite processor. Nothing here. I mean, I can see it really. It's the Menorite processor. That means it goes into science. That means it's going to be used. But if I don't have any Tensor I'm going into this space science pack. And that is crafted by here, it must be. This is really odd. There's a bit of tensile here. Mm. That one. What are we missing? We're missing the military because we don't have the scientific. Okay. And this one would require no tensile either. I'm sorry, but what? 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 Matter research data. Okay, so there's another matter research data. I did not even see that. How do we make matter research? There. And then experimental data. Experimental data is plastic plus matter, and matter is something we just make out of like raw materials okay uh that's really odd to be honest really really odd just feel like there's something missing in terms of why would i want this again this one probably not gonna keep it up so we scale it up to 50. Okay, so things are beginning to come in at a bit more regular pace, and we got a bit of tantalum. That's enough to put it in here. Bit weird. I mean, yes, we need it, but... Um, interesting how... Okay, there it is. We got uh, tantalum. And it does strike me as really odd why we... I mean... Not why we have it, because that's kind of it. All right, so at this point, I think we should take a look at what is not working. Everything seems to be waiting on the red circuits. That's totally natural. Uh, I don't know if it is, but it's not great. I'm going to take this one out and start requesting these. It's not going to be a lot, but it's going to be some. What about oil? Is that okay? Oil is doing just fine. And... Uh, that's definitely not it. Oh, another thing, right? Plastic? Not doing so hot. Not doing so hot at all. Why is that not doing so hot? Is it simply the inbound? We're not getting enough, are we? Okay, well that's a good excuse. We are simply not getting enough petroleum gas. Huh? Why are we not getting enough petroleum gas? Are there issues? Are these not working? And these are still using the old formula because I have not upgraded to the new formula. Just so you are aware. Mm. And these ones are constrained here. So they don't... This is the problem. I think this is the problem. I can simply not consume these fast enough. Light oil cannot be consumed fast enough. Okay. So we might be in a situation where light oil cannot be consumed fast enough. This is being consumed, but not the light oil. The light oil is coming up here. Uh, 
This is working, but slowly. Yeah, this is this is not really keeping up. Hmm. I, I do like this being in one location because then I can we're also at the point where I really should be using, like, using this. And then it goes slightly down in speed. No, it, it stays constant on the speed, but it gives bonus things. Uh, that doesn't really solve our main issue. The main issue here is the fact that this is just not consuming enough. I, I'm, I need more. More, 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 more. And that seems to me to be a maybe actually start building it in, like in a really grand scale we're gonna have to do this one as well but um maybe maybe it's time for us to build one of those the ones that need the most what about you you're just you're hopeless aren't you you're also hopeless very hopeless and that's gonna hold up a lot of things if you don't have sulfur or sulfuric acid Interesting, this one's making sulfuric acid directly and not making sulfur. I think it should actually have made sulfur instead. And then sulfuric acid is going to be in a different, because sulfur is going to be needed as well for explosives. Yeah. Okay. We'll do this one. And then I will try to figure out how to build... See, I don't have many of the big ones. How many do I actually have? I have that one. And other ones? No, these are still the middle ones. Where are they? How did I build the last big one? I did have one more giant one. Hmm. I cannot remember. What could that be? Oh, here they come. That, I'm... I don't remember. No? Really? Have we only... We can go up here and check out on... Yeah, it's too nasty that we do have another one. I did know that we have one. I just can't remember what it's for. Uh, oh, right, of course. That one, green circuits, always green circuits. And let's get the green circuits here. Let's get this one and then take out the blue. And you know, some of this is probably not gonna work either. This one almost certainly should be up here instead. And it's not placing it automatically, why not? Is it because I have placed it? And pen. Oh yeah, yeah, we did place it. And we uh, kind of got distracted. All right, and I forgot something. That one. Here. 50. 200. Because reasons, that's definitely should be enough. Let me just wait for it to come in. It's going to be, yeah, this is going to be a big one. I probably won't be able to make it in the time we have available, but still. Okay, we're getting some of these. How many are still inbound? 18 inbound. And we got a lot of this. All right, this should be fine. They have the last ones. Boom. Close to the last ones. This. There you go. Easy. And I will actually... I will do this. And this one is defaulting to how much? 50. It's definitely going up. So... Definitely need something like this. 
Just something, right? Just casually something here. And that's going to do a lot of water. How much does this take inbound wise? This takes uh, 15 oil. That's 30 oil. That's uh, 15 times 24. 360. Okay. That's something. 360. It's okay. It's okay. I mean, what if we take... What if we take one of these and unbarrel light oil? It's going to unbarrel five barrels of 50. That's 250. And then a faster speed. If I go like all out. So this one can unbarrel just one of those. Unbarrel 2.2 .2 times 250. That's 550 per second. This one can unbarrel 550 per second. So this one can unbarrel one of these, but not two. So what if we think... Uh, 150 divided by two, and then divided by 15. Two divided by 15. 18. So if this is not... If this was... If this was like that. Actually, I don't think this is correct. If we do... If we do this one... Then I could take... No, I couldn't. I could take this one as the... Edge and on the other side. Yeah, I think it's better to do this. Which will go out, out, and in. Yeah, much better. Cover X enrichment process. Nice. Is there something we need at this point, or should we just uh, chill a bit? I don't think there's anything we absolutely need. He said, and then start adding it. it, it it seems wrong to not take this one, but it's just so boring. We'll just take it. Yeah. Yeah, and this one again, bridge it. Yeah, we bridge these networks. That one, that one. I think this is like the safer way to do it. So this thing, I can build two of those and be completely one hundred percent unbarreling. That one, and. That one. That's going to be one full barrel unbarreling session. And then I will also get another one. Which will be a different setup. But it's going to look somewhat the same. Here. This will be... This. Just output, output. And again. Oh, we don't have productivity modules. Oh dear, I'm going to get scared. Owning these. Ugh. We are waiting for the productivity modules to flow in. How oh, they they are coming in. And that unfortunately will strain the rest of the base. But that's just the way it is. This is going to be big. I'm also going to make these ones bigger as they come along. Do we get it? Nope, not yet. Okay, here we got we got the supplies from the base and they are, now they're coming in. And that was probably not needed. There. 
You got it? Yes. Don't spend all of them there. I still need some. And this is just going to be... So let's see how much this is now more up outbound side. So the outbound side now is it produces one every two seconds. So that's going to be one every second and then plus the 12%. So that means it produces 1.12 like one of these. We take the entire capacity of the belt, 30, divided by 1.12. How much being, and that means I need 26 of these to fill up. A full belt. I don't know what this is. Maybe that's 26. 24. All right. Well, that's pretty close. And I think I actually not there, but yeah. See? 26. Don't have enough of anything. And our poor robots are a bit strained these days. There. Now this will be a full belt and that goes into, I actually need one of these that isn't a provider, but it's still going to go in here and I know you're blinking, don't care. Maybe I'll just take one of those that we'll get just eventually. We go in and that one. Good. So now inside here, I'm going to, uh, hold on. Another thing is how much is this actually consuming? It's not consuming errors. This is 26 and it's consuming 0. 0.5 times five. That's 130. That's not very much. That's really not very much. Uh, okay. So we are going to get in here. This one, just smash it into this. We don't have this is going to unbarrel like crazy. Yeah. And oh, this is actually interesting. I can't even get it into these. Okay. Undo that one. That one. And this is going to be sp fully speed modules, so we get 550. This will go into a, to a box, I guess. Anything we don't want to just uh, always get enough of, I don't think this is being used very much. Yeah. All right, let's see what we got. I need these two inbound. Damn, time is flying. All right, here. And pen. And that will be... Uh, okay, I guess we'll mark it as this one, even though it's not exactly correct. It's actually more important to do something else. I got that one. I got these. Fine. Got it. And I got a few of these, but not all of them. So maybe I went out a bit early. This one goes in here, and it will have one going up and one going over. This one going over will always go or maybe it won't. I don't know. Yes. Like this. Hold on. This didn't need to be there. This could have been there. So we put it back. And... This one will be when fluids... Yeah, this is where I need uh, the, the wire condition that we didn't have or we don't have, but right now 
I'll just keep flowing this one because it's not actually going to take much. This one will do it when uh, it's greater than 1000. Then you'll start pumping this way as well. And I will flow from here. This will be significantly less than either of them, so I think I'll just take that one. Prioritize left. And put stuff into barrels, like this. I'm going to do the same on the other side, like so. And just... From this side, I guess. Don't know if it's a bad idea to do it this way, but it's what I do. Yeah. Let's take this one. And this one will be water. Uh, inbound. Somehow I like this more. This goes, outputs all the water, goes up. Boom, boom, and inbound and inbound, and they will just be pushed out. And I got that thing to let go of the blinking. I like it. And and then we just need some wire, just, we just need some wire condition here. Okay, that one, that one, and where else? Any more? No, just two things in. And then on the outside, I will have one uh yeah we're missing something but that's okay this is going to be water so i'm gonna do it 480 <clears throat> and yeah gonna do the not dirty water 480 there we go and did I get stuff? I got a bit of this. Uh, more inbound? Yep, nine. There we go. So I got all of it. Sweet. And we kind of missed something. Something significant. This is actually really pleasing to look at. Uh, And this one has to be also prioritizing inbound. Always, always, always. Are you working? Yeah, yeah, stuff is coming out. That's nice. This one. Outbound. And inbound. Really shouldn't be having this much on the inbound side. Yep. And on the outbound side, I will just take a look. So that's actually going to be that one and that one will be out. This one is not doing anything, so why not? This one's not doing anything. What seems to be the major malfunction? You are not getting any That's going to be a little oops here. Then 
There. Now this one's also getting stuff. And that's just hard outbound. Boom. This one? Hard outbound. Yes. Maybe this one. Good. Everything is working. Uh, this one will only work once it's above that. Sure. That was easy. Oops. And I'll take... This will be our... Yeah. And... These two... Will be... Barrels. No barrels. Sweet. Wow, we did it. And then it's just a matter of uh, of taking the other one out. That is pretty damn sweet, I think. And uh, let's go in here and just also say... Boom. Yeah, okay. So, thank you very much for joining. I think it's great that we start building something at a bit more sort of modern scale. Let's uh, call it that. And... Uh, it's definitely needed for us to scale up. Uh, this one also needs to be scaled up. We can probably put it here and just figure out what uh, what goes on from there. And if we start, if we are actually able to start consuming this too fast, then we have another oil deposit out here. Pretty good. Rad research is getting halfway, so that's something. It's not a lot, but it's something. Thank you very much for joining. Oh, by the way, I think that maybe someone would like to see, uh, oh, not that, pollution. Look at the pollution cloud. It's actually going really far inwards here. These are just completely cleaned up. This is cleaned up. There's really no pollution outside of our domain. Very small out here, but yeah, very, very small, as I said. So definitely not. I mean, we. this is the. This is honestly the best way to deal with biters that I've seen. Um, great that I have the option of not killing them, but actually just letting them be where they are. So pretty damn awesome with those purifiers. So with that, thank you very much for joining. Hope to see you in the next episode. Until then, stay effective.